I'm going to show you how to boot into the directory services restore mode on an Active Directory domain controller. So to do this, you want to press the start menu and type msconfig.exe and then press enter. And then in the system configuration page, you can come to the boot tab, select safe mode, and then select Active Directory Repair. Now, before you apply this, you want to make sure that you have the DSRM password for the domain controller. So if you do need to reset that, all you need to do is open up a PowerShell and then within PowerShell and then run NTDS util. And then we can do set DSRM password and then do reset password on server and then the host name of the server you want to reset the directory services restore mode password for. It will then ask you to type a password. So we will enter this password and then enter the new password again. That password's been set successfully. So we can just do Q and then Q to quit. And now we've selected safe mode with the Active Directory repair mode selected. We can press apply and then OK. And then we can restart the server and then it will boot into the directory services restore mode. Now the server's booted, we'll have to select other user. Now, because we've booted it into the directory services restore mode, if we try and log in with a domain account, so in this case, the domain administrator, we will get an error to say that we can't do it. Now that is because the directory services aren't actually running when we're in the directory services restore mode. So what we need to do is log into the local administrator account on the server. So to do that, we can do dot and then backslash and then administrator. And then we can see we're signing into DC1 and not into the domain. And then the password for this account is the DSRM password that we've just set or that you had already saved. So we can just enter the DSRM password and then press enter. And then it will log us into the server using the local administrator account. So now we're actually logged into the server. The directory services won't actually be running. However, now you can restore any backup or do any maintenance that you need us to do with the server in the directory services restore mode. Once you've finished doing the maintenance, if you press the start menu again and run msconfig.exe and then come back to the boot tab, to take it out of the DSRM mode, we just unselect safe boot, press apply and then OK, and then restart. Then once the server's rebooted, we can log in using a domain account. So we'll do ad backslash administrator. We can see it's signing into the domain and not the local domain controller. And then I will enter the administrator password. And now it's signed me in to my domain administrator account, showing that the directory services have started and it's been able to authenticate the password. So that's how you can boot a server into the directory services restore mode. And then how you can take it out of that and boot it back into the normal mode.